Hello everyone, this is Evil Tig 13. I um I've been having some issues with my new computer by way of if I want to um burn it came with a Blu-ray burner and when I want to burn an MKV file to Blu-ray, none of the software that I use will do it, <clears throat> will accomplish it. So what I've and I'm gonna show you what I do, what I like to do to make a disc real quick so that you have an idea what um um, how changing this MKV works for me and it may not work for you um, for the steps you're taking with your programs but I like to use DVD Architect and I'll go to File New Blu-ray Disc and then I'll either import the movie as one one movie or I'll create a menu here with uh, you know an hour long home video here, an hour long home video here, an hour long home video here and then I burn the disk but when I have an a MKV file I can't do that it won't let me drag and it locks everything up so this is what I like to burn the blu-ray disk with this is what I like to edit it with Sony Vegas Pro 11 and you can't even pull the MKV file in there it'll lock it up and you gotta hit control alt delete to, to close it and everything <coughs> Now, the, the one thing I found to work so far to convert the MKV files is IM2 Video Converter Ultimate 6. This I've been converting to MPEG-4 videos and it seems to be working. I tried MPEG-2 TS and that didn't work out. <clears throat> it still had issues with uh, getting it into Vegas things were locking up so I was able to um, um, to do this in MPEG-4 and the video still looks good it still retains enough of the quality to where it looks like uh, it's full HD obviously but uh, the package doesn't get that big it'll still fit on the disk um, I think this is six gigs and it comes out at like well the output size is six gigs <clears throat> the input size was much smaller but uh, this one was uh, that's about the same um, so yeah I'm to video converter ultimate six and you've got the option uh, there's a lot of different um, outputs you can use I can't click on it right now because it's um, rendering these and it's taken to do four um, <clears throat> it says there's 34 minutes left and it's 63.6 percent done and it's been doing it for an hour so an hour and a half to do four uh, yeah four full-length movies that's that's pretty good now <clears throat> I read through message boards and I tried to find a, a way to do it and excuse me for my cough and I, I, I'm developing a cold from this dreary weather but um, people suggested the um, <clears throat> suggested this and it's actually pretty cool and fast you put the MKV, MKV in and it outputs it as um, Oh, I can't remember. Configuration. Oh, okay, MPEG-2. And uh, MT2S is the output extension. And you can pick AVI, MP4, VOB, M2TS, MPEG. And then the transcoding. <coughs> you can, uh, a lot of little settings you can mess with. But it didn't work for me. It says PS3 video converter. So I'm assuming that if I had a PS3, this would work better. So that video I watched led me down the wrong path um, <clears throat> not their fault though I should have read into it more but um, yeah that didn't work out too well <clears throat> and the uh, IM2 Blu-ray is pretty cool it um, <clears throat> it did what it says it'll do but it did it wrong it um, I burnt uh, some MKVs to a Blu-ray disc and it burned it, it looked great, but the sound was off by like 10 seconds. It wasn't even close 
people would talk and leave the room and the scene would change and then you'd hear them talking and leaving the room after the fact so this would have been um, it's almost like some AV, uh, some MKVs worked and some didn't it's almost like the packaging is different depending on who ripped it and what software they used and what encoding and or uh, the um, sound and everything I'm not 100% sure I don't understand it 100% sure on on what it is but um, with this you can put the movie in 1920 by 1080 you can pick this and the video quality and then uh, <clears throat> you basically hit burn and it burns it to the disk um, yeah it didn't work for me though so so far the only thing that's worked for me has been the IM2 video converter ultimate 6 and like I said the, uh, this thing you can you can pick all kinds of uh, files from iPod HDTV Blu-ray I mean uh, anything so check that out if you're having trouble with MKV files and you can convert them down to something you can uh, work with and uh, I hope it helps somebody and I'll, I'll come back and uh, do another video showing uh, how I make the blu-ray disc how I author it if anybody's interested just post below subscribe right all that good nonsense all right everyone take care let me see how I cut this um, oh I hit f10 f10 everyone take care